Good morning, friends. It's finally the end of the week. Can you believe we made it through a whole nother week? Let's get started. Good morning, good morning. Hello and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, and I hope that you are too. All right, are you ready to stand for the pledge? Here we go. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now we get to see what day it is, and I'll give you a hint. It's Miss Paula's favorite day of the week. Days 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 of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 Yesterday was th -th Thursday. Today is f -f Friday. My favorite day. It is fun Friday. And tomorrow will be. Saturday. So tomorrow is a weekend. Remember, Saturday and Sunday are the weekends because they're at the end of the week. And we will not have a meeting on Monday because Monday is a holiday. It's Memorial Day. So I hope that you have some fun this weekend with your family and celebrate and enjoy the weekends. The weekend, I should say. All right, so today is Friday and it is still May and we need to see if it's going to be a pink flower or a yellow flower. Pink, pink, yellow, yellow. 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 Pink. You're right, it is pink. And it is number 22. A two and a two. That's 22. Let's count 22. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. It is Friday, May 22nd. That's another way of saying 22. 2020. <clears throat> and I thought we would go ahead and write that on our message board again today since we haven't done the date on there in a little while. And see if you can remember what letters make these sounds so we can fill in the missing letters. Ta ta today. Remember? Ta ta T. That's a capital T. Today is that tricky vowel I, I. letter i is friday i have a different letter missing remember what letter we did on wednesday it says its name a mm -hmm. here it is friday oops can't make it very good there friday and we put in our a may there it is again saying its name. A. Yes, you're getting to be such good writers. M A. We'll put it in. 22nd, 2020. It. I. I. Another vowel, I. But this time we're going to put a capital I because it's at the beginning of a sentence. We have our period there and our beginning of a sentence. So we'll put a capital I there. That was a lowercase i. It is. Z. Can you remember what letter makes that sound? Sometimes it says, and sometimes it says z. Is, it's an s like our snake. Is rainy. Today is rainy. Do you hear that letter a again? Rainy. Yes, there it is. We had a lot of a's in our message today. Let's read the message together. Today is Friday, May 22nd, 2020. It 
is rainy. Mm -hmm. All right, so I thought we would review a lot of our letters today and our shapes and see what you can remember. So before we do that though, I should show you our weather bear. He is dressed in his rain gear today. And usually Miss Paula is not very excited about rainy days, but today I am. Do you know why? I was so glad he got to put on his rain gear today because I told you I was gonna work on my garden. And I did, and I worked on my garden. I had some help from a couple family members that I was really thrilled that they were able to come over and help me. And they did a lot of work. We got all my flower beds in and we did all that yesterday before it rained. Now it's raining. And remember I said we need rain to make the flowers grow. So now we're getting a lot of rain so that my flowers will grow nice and pretty. So what's the weather like today? Like today, like today. What's the weather like today? Today is rainy. Maybe I will take my video out and video my flower gardens and show you so that you can see how the rain makes them grow very pretty since we've been talking a lot about that this month. That would be a fun thing to do. I'll try to remember to do that maybe later today. Okay, so in reviewing our letters, we have a lot of letters that we have learned. We will start with our new letter, letter A. A says A, eh, and A says A. A, A, ant, A, A, apple, and we could also say A, A, airplane. I says I, 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 iguana, I, I, igloo, can also say I like I, I, ice cream. B says like b b ball b b button. S says s, 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 sun and s, s, star. J says j j j jaguar j j jellyfish. T says t t, t tree t, t train. M says mm, 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 monkey. Mm, mm, mushroom. L says ooh, 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 lion. Ooh, ooh, leaf. R says rr, rr, rocket. Rr, rr, rabbit. F says flower. Frog. C says k, 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 cloud. K, k, cat. D says d, 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 dragonfly, d, d, drum. P says p, 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 pig, p, p, penguin. H says h, h, cat, h, h, horse. E says e, 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 egg, e, e, elephant, and e, Eat, um, eat. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be doing a story on probably Wednesday, maybe, about Elmer the elephant. That's one of my favorites. I love Elmer the elephant. And I thought he would be a good E story. So you have that to look forward to. All right. I also wanted to review my shapes. Remember, we have Sammy Square, he has four sides, and no matter how you turn him, he's going to look the same, especially if he does not have a face on, huh? He's going to look the same. My four sides are all the same. Sammy Square is my name. Can you remember who our new one was? He only had three sides. One, two, three. My three sides. Are, are, I'm sorry, count my sides. One, two, three, 
Tommy triangle, that is me. Should I do that one more time since I messed up? Count my sides. One, two, three. Tommy triangle, that is me. And then we have another one with four sides, but this time they're not all the same. Sometimes he's tall and sometimes he's long. Two sides short, two sides long. This is Randy Rectangle's song. This is Rectangle. And then we have this little guy here. Round and round and round I go. I look like a ball. I'm Circle Joe. So we have our circle. And we talked about this one, the oval that looks like a squish circle. And we talked about our heart that shows we love people. Heart symbolizes love. And our twinkle, twinkle little star. We have learned all of our shapes and so many letters. Boys and girls, you're really getting ready for kindergarten. All right, I have a story here for you today. And it is about five little sharks. And I also have a song that will go along with it later. Five little sharks swimming in the sea. And it is by Steve Metzger. I almost forgot to tell you, the author, illustrator. Five little sharks swimming in the sea. Hmm, let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. You see them? <gasps> One bumped into a giant manatee. Oh, no. No more, sh and, um, the mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more sharks swimming in the sea. Just like we used to have the no more monkeys. Yep, this is no more sharks. No more monkeys jumping on the bed and this is no more sharks swimming in the sea. I had a little brain lapse there for a minute. Four little sharks splashing by the shore. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Let's see what happens. Oh, what are they gonna do this time? <gasps> One got stuck on the ocean floor. See how he's stuck? The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more sharks splashing by the sea. That mom is taking away all the fun, huh? Do moms do that sometimes? We have to, oh, let's count them. One, two, three. Three little sharks racing past a whale. Ooh, I wonder what's gonna happen. See that big whale? One got close and banged his tail. Ouch! The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more sharks racing past a whale. No more. The two little sharks playing hide and seek. One, two. One got lost and was missing for a week. They couldn't find him, oh no. The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more sharks playing hide and seek. No, no, no. One little shark swimming all alone. He doesn't have any shark friends. There's lots of fish, but no shark friends. Ate too much fish and began to groan. Oh, he has a belly ache. No, and mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more sharks swimming all alone. Oh, that mom's a busy mom. She has to keep track of all these busy sharks. Now there's no little sharks swimming in the sea. No little sharks as happy as can be because that's where they like to be is in the sea swimming. The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, what do you think the doctor said? Mm -hmm. 
Let those sharks swim wild and free. Let them go back out and swim. So that's what they did. Isn't that nice? All right. So I have a song that I'm going to share with you. Let me erase my message board. And I'm going to put my shark friends on here. And we have five of them. And we are going to sing five little sharks swimming in the sea. So let me put them on. We have one. You can count with me. Two. Three. Four. And five. One, two, three, four, five. So let me get my song ready and we'll begin. Five little sharks went swimming one day down in the bay where all the sharks play. Mommy shark said, What comes back? But only four little, little sharks, sharks came, came back. back. Oh no, only four. One, two, three, four. See if I can get my number four. Four little sharks went swimming one day down in the bay where all the sharks play. Mommy shark said, Oh, come What's back. That? But only three little sharks came back. But now only three sharks. Three little sharks went swimming one day. Down in the bay where all the sharks play. Mommy shark said, Who comes back? But only two little sharks came back. Only two? Memorial Day weekend, and I will be looking forward to seeing you back on Wednesday. Now, if you're watching, let mommies and daddies know I won't be sending this video out anymore um, individually to you, but I will be posting on our YouTube channel. So check the YouTube channel, and for the next couple of weeks, I will have um, videos out, and then after the first week of June, we will be all done and on summer break. Have a fabulous weekend, boys and girls. Bye. It is time to say goodbye to all our friends. It is time to say goodbye to all our friends. It is time to say goodbye. It is time to say goodbye. It is time to say goodbye to all our friends. Bye, friends. Have a fabulous weekend.